different stuff that you don't even know yet and it's really cool to learn all of these things because it just makes you feel like you're like a teacher because you know a lot of stuff. We have a great vision in the province of Alberta for education. Alberta Education's vision is to ensure that our students are engaged thinkers and ethical citizens with an entrepreneurial spirit. Students who are highly engaged in learning do learn better and more deeply. What can you do to really meet the needs of every student in the school and at the same time build the capacity of our teachers in our school? So what that meant for us is every afternoon, myself, the learning coach, gets to work with every teacher in the school. They take turns meeting with me and we take their lessons and we say, how do we improve this? How do we make sure that it meets the needs of everyone? How can we make sure it's engaging? How do we make sure it's 21st century learning? And really it means moving from very teacher-centered, one-size-fits-all practice to moving towards student-centered instruction. You know, it's been really exciting to see the students become very excited about this project. They know that I'm working with their teachers, their teachers talk about their learning as well as teachers, and so the types of lessons that we're doing are very focused on the kids and very engaging because they really are excited to share that they're successful, that they were good at something, that they thought of something, and it wasn't just them receiving some knowledge. We're committed to quality, excellent teaching for every single student. And so once they realize this meant at the elbow help that they could have time to do those things they always wanted to do with their students they got very excited so this year in our school we've been focusing on making our classrooms more student-centered spaces so we're really looking at students being able to create the knowledge create the understanding and the teachers being there as facilitators and guides and setting up the learning and the experiences so that the students can collaborate and they can create and they can build their own knowledge and understanding we've been integrating technology as well but technology not for students to to use to consume materials that other people have created but technology for students to create and students to build and also I think that teachers had a real realization that if they're effective um, that it improves student learning and that's really motivating for teachers all our teachers here they want kids learning they want kids excited and they're happy to do that work um, and and because our district provided the supports to do that work I think they, they were happy to get on board I think the biggest thing that we've seen is student engagement in the classes that we have done this work in when we have really sat down to look at how can we make this a student-centered place where they're building their understanding and knowledge and, and then demonstrating that we saw students who were highly engaged. Students not only had more freedom demonstrating their knowledge but were able to come back and use the essential question and content explored in a way that made sense to them. The students themselves are incredibly enthusiastic about this chance they greatly enjoy the opportunity to work in groups and to share with others what they know. Using a learning story or documentation really brought me in touch with what was happening with my students' learning. They also realized that their thought process was important. They began to see themselves as thinkers rather than receivers of facts. We're at interesting times because of the technology piece. So with students being one click away from potentially getting results, answers, um, how-tos, um, we actually have to have students learn how to consume the subjects that they're learning. So traditionally math is very algorithmic based where as long as they know the steps, then they can produce the answers, which is fine for certain elements of math because math is, has a lot of process involved. Um, but if, if the students are um, trying to answer application-based questions, then they have to learn to think critically. I find that if you're just turning pages, that um, oftentimes students just disengage because they know that today we're working on page 10 and tomorrow we're working on page 11. So what I try to do is take the main concept, the material from an experience point of view, uh, and that experience allows us a framework by which we can jump from. 
So we, we have to foster um, in, environments that promote that critical thinking. I wrote some poetry because math wasn't really my subject, it still isn't, so I decided to use like my English skills to kind of transfer that over into understanding math. It was really personalized that I'd be able to understand rather than just random examples that if I look back on them in a year I wouldn't understand at all. So doing it this way and even making it rhyme as well, um, like the song slash poetry form, definitely kind of grinds some of the concepts into my head and helps me study them better and learn them better. To be honest, I don't remember anything from grade 10. I always shake my head and say no when people ask remember when. Math is, is a little different. My seemingly never-ending journey with trigonometry. Oh, what a joy. Although it's probably seemed hard at the time, the concept of I think it's really cool because you're a very good teacher and it makes me really happy that you're helping, like, instead of just using your time just to, like, plan stuff, you actually teach, too. Then it helps us know what we're going to be getting through, and you help us so that we know what we're going to be doing next. Principals and teachers are collaborating to make the vision of 21st century education come alive through our professional development model called TRANSFORM. As the superintendent of Edmonton Catholic Schools, I am very proud of how our school communities are transforming to ensure excellent teaching and learning for all students.